Hey guys, Zuljin here, and welcome back to another episode of Abandoned Ship. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Let's continue. Check out Pirate Ship Spotted. It matches the description of a rogue. Uh oh, the Halifron thing. Or no, is that. What's coming for me? Yeah, it's the Kraken. Okay. Let's fight the Kraken first. Ah, dang it. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, let's see. Positions. And... Hentai! <laughs> it's too bad I can't just, like, shoot it or whatever. Alright. <laughs> Tentacle. Tentacle. Uh, I don't want to do my maneuver board here. There we go. Everybody's on something. Except the captain. Captain sailing away. Yes. Oh, the maneuver board is full already? Holy crap. Captain. That three navigation is impressive, my friend. I think we got it. Wow. How fast was that? Incredible, man. I can't wait until I can beat that thing. Okay. Seriously. We're going after the captain now. Uh, I mean, the pirates now. Word is spread about a troublesome pirate. You get a discount at the local port. We definitely want to do this. We definitely want a discount at the local port. Uh, okay. Beautiful, man. Look at the sea. How rough right now. <whistles> Amazing. All right. The grape shot is loaded. Now I'm just going to go assist on the cannons here. And the mortar is just about ready to go. And the chain shot is ready to go. And now the cannons are ready to go. Okay, we definitely don't want to destroy this ship. We want to get on board and, and do damage to it. We are close enough. Okay. Gunner. Nice. We were able to do it. We can ram them now. Brace. Beautiful. Nice. Okay, we're almost grape shot ready here. Let's take two of the guys here and all go for the captain. Grape shot is gonna hit like right here. Oh, that was good. That was so good. Go board, boys. Do it to it. Uh uh. Where y'all where you going? Where you going? Huh? Where you going? <laughs> where you going? <laughs> you can you can run, but you can't hide. We on your ship now, boy. Perfect, man. Okay. Yeah, we captured him. 38 and 16. And we're going to have... Uh, we're going to have a discount at the local port if we can find it. Uh, let's see. Encounter a ship listing to one side. Plumes of water erupting from the deck without rapid intervention. Soon will sink. Uh, plot a course straight for them. We get some supplies for helping. Wonderful. Wonderful. It would be so nice. <gasps> there it is. We found a port. Beautiful. Okay. Shipwright. 290. We can afford the second the largest ship in the game. <laughs> uh, let's do it, man. Let's do it. Customize and purchase. Okay. Transfer all upgrades. Transfer all weapons. Beautiful. Total cost of the new ship is 239. Purchase. Okay. Confirm purchase. Old ship sell value. That's really good. Okay. So we got we got a new ship now. It doesn't feel like a new ship, does it? 
But it definitely we we bought it though, didn't we? <laughs> I don't understand. I really don't understand. All right, we had to have bought it because we it it took the money. It just doesn't look any different. I guess that's okay. <laughs> I guess that's okay. So weird, man. Um, let's see. I like our crew right now. I don't think we have to worry about it. Oh, you could uh, you could fast travel. I just noticed. Okay, tackler, a long range swivel gun designed to target and stun individual crew. Oh, that's really good. Uh, knocks individual crew to the floor, but doesn't cause any damage. Has a chance of knocking crew overboard. Infinite range. That's actually pretty good. Like you could start using that early on because the range is infinite. Round shot cannon that offers fires to start. Low damage to hull and sections. Low damage to crew. Moderate chance of causing fires. Hull cracker cluster bomb. I think we're okay with the setup that we currently have. We just have better ships. So let's go to upgrades. And I think we could buy some of this. Heavy hull armor would be nice. Why can't we, uh, we drag that on? I don't understand why it won't let us. It let us upgrade that a while ago, but it does not let us there. Huh. Oh well. I don't know why it's not letting us, but we're gonna move on because this just took entirely too long. Uh, let's see. Sail straight back to sea. Uh, we're all repaired, so we should be able to go here. Hmm. I'm sorry I fumbled around with that so long, guys. I have no idea what the deal is there. Send a lifeboat ashore to trade? No. It's not worth... I don't need all those supplies. I can still sell a ton of supplies that I already have. Looks like there's something in the water here. You fish the body of a castaway out of the water, you never tell whether they're unconscious or dead. Unfortunately, this one is long gone. His body's beginning to show signs of rotting. Ew. As you check him over, you see a beautiful piece of jewelry. We got 22 bucks from that. Okay, an enemy ship has somehow taken you completely unaware and now target your weaker side. We don't, we don't have a weaker side. We don't have a weaker side, except for the fact that our guys are on the weaker side. We are fully upgraded and ready to go here. Uh-huh. Now what, suckers? Oh, we're already in range, too. How about that? How about that? shot again. Oh no, this is the chain shot. Nice. Alright, we're ramming them. Brace! We doing it. We're doing it. Beautiful. Go get them, boys. All hands on deck. Okay. It's all done. It's all she wrote. <laughs> Very nice. Leave combat. <laughs> Our boarding crew is vicious, man. Those guys are bare knuckle fighters. <laughs> They're so used to combat. They just jump ship every day and just start destroying people. All right, and we have five of nine unlocked for the way back. I have no idea what we have above us. Because I was going straight for port, which worked out to buy a ship, but at the same time didn't really let us have any upgrades. If I was missing something, guys, I'm sorry. 
Uh, cry goes up. Your ship has seen in the distance throughout your spyglass. You can tell it's already changed course and head straight for you. Its intention is clearly hostile. Uh, yeah, let's destroy him. Let's just destroy him straight out. Having a cr full crew with this is, is just so good. You can overtake them so easily. All right, grape shot is charged. We're ready to go. I really wish I had a second gunner, man. Like, who is strong in guns? Captain is on four right now. That's unbelievable. Uh, guns, three. Yep. Yeah. Guns, one. Guns, one. Guns, one. Guns, one. Yeah, we, we definitely need to probably trade somebody out there. I would love to get a gunner on chain shot as well. If we're close enough, this is going to be great. Okay, we might as well shoot. Still not out of, still not in uh, range yet. Gonna need one more chain shot. Should probably switch around gunners right now. That would probably be the best thing. That way chain shot gets closer. But I really hate when we're already in range to start with. Because having grape shot available at very first shot is so nice, man. Okay, I'm gonna go heal my fighter here before we go for impact. All right. Medic uh, back over here. Okay, one more Mordic, one more grape shot. Mordic, mortar. Oh yeah, brace. Tidal wave incoming. Oh, shit. I didn't even realize that. Look at that tidal wave, man. Wow. That was pretty cool. A tidal wave of all things. Brace for impact. They're not going to be ready for this. They just now getting ready again. Bye. <laughs> oh, somebody went overboard. Y'all screwed, man. Y'all are screwed. Uh, there. <laughs> That's all she wrote. Look how much damage their ship is in right now. I guess, I guess we can leave now. Yep. <laughs> oh boy, just you saw him float right off there. Now I can leave combat. That tidal wave was cool. That was new. A formidable cult ship has been spotting. It's hunting you. All right. Fine. We'll wait. <laughs> We're like destroying things now. Look, you see, they're in range already. Now it pays to have grape shot ready uh, to go, man. We're not going to get any nothing from this, unfortunately. There's a Halifron right there, too. I see him. I see the Halifron. Nice. We can't get supplies, so we may as well sink them. There's the Halifron. Shoot him! They're going for the medic bay. So I'm gonna hit the medic bay. Let's get out of here.
think we all right. How'd they fare over here? <laughs> Not too good, huh? <laughs> Dude, I am destroying them. Y'all wanted to come over here, huh? Shoot him. All right. Yeah, there's not much they can do now. Not Yay. much they can do. Tidal wave incoming. Let's go miss. Look, one guy overboard. <laughs> one guy overboard. Switch in here. Think I'm switching. We just gonna double up, triple up. We'll be able to we'll be able to destroy him in no time, man. And I'm just gonna keep this guy on his toes with my mortars. Going down, boys. They going down. He's trying to fix everything, poor guy. About to get bombed on again. Trace for impact. Oh. Not a wave. And their ship is sunk. <laughs> Yay! That's it. That's what you get for attacking us, fool. Yeah, the cult know where we are. Blah, blah, blah. $22. Okay, that was six of nine if we want to go back the way we came. But going north here, let's see what we got. There's a port that we've been to already. We should probably just heal up. Uh, let's repair all for 20 Still can't get any upgrades, I don't think, or sell any upgrades, huh? Can we sell this mortar? Well, let's go to upgrades first and see if we could sell or add crow's nest or whatever. Hmm. Apparently not. Okay. Well, we'll see. The gates are open, actually. Perfect. Reach Devil Rock and explore it. We're here. There's only one way to go on this one is forward. Okay. Port here. Uh, actually, let's sail straight back to sea. We'll grab this and then go to port. <laughs> okay. Bar shot built in to stop enemy movement. Okay, we had already saw that. Suppression. Swivel gun designed to knock enemy crew to the floor and stun them. Okay. Ooh, a sniper. Sniper is designed to cause maximum damage to single crew. That is nice. I think that would be amazing. Where can this get put, though? Okay, it's one of them, huh? Uh, I love my grape shot being there. I really do. Grape shot is just such a good deal, and we already have the ability to close in on them. I actually think our setup is 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 good. Uh, let's go to upgrades. Winch hull armor. We decide. Now it lets us put that on it. Good. I guess the other shop was just bugged or something. I don't know. Okay, winch. I still we have a winch already. Automatic winch. That's neat. Harpoons when fired. No, we don't need any of that stuff. Uh, cannons are all good. Yeah, I think I think we're good here. Uh, let's go to shipwright and see. Frigate is six fifty. That's our next one up. Um, 
So we're gonna have to... Let's check out, um, visit the tavern. So, right now we're looking at the... We, we would love another gunner. Joshua is a good gunner here. Samuel is probably our weakest. But he's another medic, so I hate to get rid of him. Um, they're all good fighters, so that... Well, except Samuel. Samuel's not that good of a fighter. But having two medics is really nice. But I think another gunner, man, would just... Would be the icing on the cake. I really do. I can gun pretty well as Zuljin. I'll tell you what. Samuel... I think you go. Kara is is definitely better than you. So we dismiss. And I think we pick up... I think we pick up... Joshua. Joshua can fight. And he can... Um, and he can really gun. So that's what we're going to do. 140. Well now why can't I pick up Joshua, man? Joshua. Yeah, something is bugged out. <laughs> something is bugged out with this. What the heck? Uh, let's explore the town. The port town is ramshackle and sparse. Many houses lying empty. You find a sorry looking trading shack and proprietary mutters directions to someone who can apparently who apparently is capable of helping. As you approach your supposed destination, a fair a, a pair of filthy street urchins lob a chunk of dull stone into a puddle next to you. The water seems to spit for a second with floor exploding, soaking your britches. The children flee, shrieking with laughter, and you can't help but be impressed by their small demonstration. You arrive at it a hut and stranded apart from the others. With strange symbols painted over the door, this is the place. The door is yanked open by an older man with a bearded <laughs> with beard oiled into multiple points at inconsistent angles. His face is a little mess of many small scars, and one in his eye is glass, painted with a crude iris. <laughs> you've some you've seen some salty sea dogs in your time, but this guy takes the biscuit. He clearly isn't one for formalities, so you come right out with it. You're in the business of hunting exotic sea fauna and need a tactical edge. You attempt to flatter him by explaining that Devil Rock's recent infamy has a reputation led you here. He sets off on accounts of his glory days spent fishing and exploring using Devil Rock. Uh, he would seal nuggets in dark, uh, of dark rock in oiled spherical containers packed with sand. Uh, then it was just a matter of finding a shoal to drop it overboard where once deep enough the pressure would be forced would force water in and set off the reaction he minge, he mimes a huge vertical torrent of water we considered it good luck he winks and a fish chunk landed in your head <laughs> you make quick calculation about how much devil rock you would need to surface something as big as a kraken and quickly resolve it would take out half of your ship at the same time hardly ideal do you ever experiment with launch methods like firing it from a mortar the man looks blankly at you for a second <laughs> before a large smile creases on his gnarled features. I like his style, he proclaims, but no, we never needed to. He rummages around in his pockets and produces a small pebble and places it atop a platter, a large chest. Grabs a nearby candle and passes the flame slowly back and forth over the stone. Instinctively, you flinch uh, and make to cover your eyes, and he just grins. Friction or heat do nothing, only water. We'll need to do some tests, but thank you. The man's eyes lit up. He is desperate to be part of his experiment and volunteers some supplies from the good old days. His only request is that you, he can accompany you for the rest. You agree, but you will have a lot of explaining to the crew before they're happy with you bringing a soluble high explosive on board. Let's find a secluded spot for our little test. Okay, Devil Rocket is extremely vol volatile. You need to test it. It can be launched safely from a mortar. Wow. Uh, okay. Depth charge. Man the mortar. When it's ready to fire, aim at the area of the sea to launch the devil rock around. Okay. I'm ready to go. Let's see what happens. 
Nice. Your guest dances a little jig, ecstatic at the successful test. This just might work. Back to port to collect more Devil Rock supplies. In route, your guest sidles up to you. The amount of Devil Rock you plan to fire, you're not just after a few hulls or a trophy, are you? You hesitate but figure the knowledge won't hurt him, even if he believes you. No, we hunt a kraken, and it hunts us. After a pregnant pause, he replies, I've lived through many seasons. Most of them spent at sea. I have seen things men would mock me to hear tell. Another lengthy pause, I believe you, and I were and were I a few scores seasons younger, I'd join you to see for myself. As you adjust the wheel, your slip rides your sleeves rod rides up, revealing the edge of your cult tattoos. He does a good job of pretending not to notice, and you sail the rest of the way into port silence. You mull over the next steps you need to make place to make a stand as it were back in port you make preparations for your departure Balin is eluent <laughs> ebullient to find I don't, I don't know what that word is and uh and helpful carefully measuring and packaging out enough devil rock to take care of a dozen kraken he shows you a sphere container wrapped in an extra layer of oily bandage this will help keep it safe in bad weather but should slip off easily underwater be no fun if the damn things went off in your hands um, or holds would it he cackles you have a little time left until your crew have readied themselves how do you spend it oversee actively upon the ship head back to explore the port after mooring up the docks you give permission to the crew to commence in a short leave what business do you attend okay we want to visit again uh, there is nothing new here let's go to upgrade upgrades there's nothing new all right i guess that's it visit the tavern can we recruit joshua yet no it doesn't let us hmm i have no idea why we can't recruit joshua here we have the money okay i guess we just returned to port we're gonna be one man short uh, but we're going to go from there. That, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. Sorry about the problems. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, give me some dap on that like button and show you support. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Uljin signing off. And we'll see you next time.